360 Blockchain Inc. is an investment firm that specializes in blockchain technologies and opportunities in this growing field. We do believe that blockchain will be the defining technology of the coming decade, much as the internet was to the 90s. And we're a very early mover in this space, seeking early stage opportunities. 360 Blockchain USA was formed as the U.S. subsidiary of the parent company, which trades in Canada, so we can make more investments in U.S. opportunities more easily and efficiently. Pressline was launched in 2016 as a mostly media-oriented tool to encourage media transparency and trustworthiness. This was years before the whole fake news thing took over. So seeing an opportunity to build a larger platform, 360 Inc. is taking over Pressland and we're going to relaunch it as a blockchain-powered platform. The advantage is, rather than just being a crowdsourced tool, which is what it was originally, we're now going to build it as an enterprise-level platform. Our first product is to create the largest, most dynamic, reliable media media list out there. In this way, uh, we believe that the only way to know what's true and trustworthy is to know who's behind the news. So that's going to be Pressland's initial product, is the enterprise platform for news trustworthiness. Then in sort of our second stage, we will encourage other third-party developers and we'll develop our own products to create widgets and other crowdsourced tools to fight actual fake news. But we're really looking for the media trustworthiness angle. To make this happen, we're putting on the blockchain because we believe in the power of the blockchain to be an immutable, auditable, and unalterable record without a central authority. So if you want to tell people to trust your data, there's no better way than to make it transparent and decentralized, to take it away from any single entity's control. So that's what Pressland is going to do. Part of this process will probably be issuing our own token, uh, you know, our own cryptocurrency coin essentially, a token that will reward participation. So in this way, we can keep the media list as current as possible, up to the minute changes, and we'll reward our participants for coming in and uploading their data, verifying data, and reporting say, shady outlets and actual fake news products. Silicon Valley Crypto Lab is a really interesting new business that we're involved in, in Silicon Valley, as the name suggests. It's our first entry into cryptocurrency mining, which is how new Bitcoins and other cryptocurrencies and tokens are generated. Miners are rewarded for their computational energy that they put in. So at the SV Crypto Lab, we have a very large, sophisticated mining operation, and we're using the revenues from that mining to fund another business, which is a hacker space. So we're opening a community space, kind of a coffee shop, kind of a co-working space, designed for cryptocurrency and blockchain enthusiasts. Uh, why we think it's interesting is because it is a new model. It's not just using the mining as its own revenue source, it's really using it to fund other businesses. And Silicon Valley may not be the best place in terms of energy efficiency for cryptocurrency mining, but it's our first sort of foothold there. Silicon Valley is still the hotbed for a lot of technological talent, and we'll expand outward. We'll find other opportunities where the energy costs make it you know, more optimum to open these kind of operations. Not, I wouldn't call it a franchise, but I'd say we are going to expand out to other locations as the numbers work out and uh, it makes sense to open them. Arcology is our ground up build of a new blockchain technology. If you think of Bitcoin as the grandfather of blockchain technology, which it is, this is where blockchain came from, Bitcoin is 1.0, or the blockchain that runs Bitcoin is 1.0. It's, it's a robust, powerful software you know, application of blockchain. Ethereum, I would say, is uh, version 2 because it added a programming language on top of Bitcoin. Now, everybody is really looking for what 3.0 is going to be. And there's a lot of different ideas, and nobody's not quite sure what it should look like. There are problems in the current blockchains. They're energy inefficient. Um, they're, they could be slow. They don't scale well. They could be expensive. So there's a lot of different solutions out there, and we think we have a great one. Arcology is going to introduce, um, it's going to combine artificial intelligence and machine learning to make the blockchain hierarchical. If you think of current blockchains as sort of a flat circle with all the nodes talking to each other as a peer-to-peer, -peer, we're going to turn the blockchain into a layer cake. We're going to add hierarchical, dynamic self-organization to the blockchain. It's, it's a really big moonshot. Um, it's going to take at least a year to sort of get the math and technology even out the door. But we're really excited. We think it will be on the scale and size of an Ethereum or a Ripple.